There, there we go. There's our Let's downtown, downtown. Westview. Yeah. yeah, where uh, we have no dust storms, no, no rain don't. that we've got to worry about. No, it's it's uh, uh, calm out there. Pretty nice night. We had a nice evening, uh, a little bit of sunshine finally breaking out, and it right. uh, looks like we'll see a little bit of sun tomorrow. That may help fuel some more storms. But though, not so. going to wash out the no. barbecue plans? It's not a washout. Okay. You'll get those in, I okay. think. Just uh, going to have to keep an eye on the sky for okay. us. Things are mild out there this evening with the quiet conditions. We have low to mid 70s on the map, 74 in Indianapolis and Terre Haute. It's 75 in Columbus. As we take you to True View radar here, you can see again things are quiet, but as we look back to the west, there's a nasty line of thunderstorms that stretches through much of Iowa back through Kansas City and into Kansas. That's prompted all the areas in yellow thunderstorm watch, and you see that red. That's a tornado watch. This system will be heading our way, but but it's going to be a little while before we get in on some rain. We can't rule out a shower or thunderstorm starting off by the mid-morning, but I think this is going to be on a very isolated basis for us. As we go into the afternoon, you notice a little bit of sunshine, some clouds rolling through, but rain still very limited as we go through the bulk of the day. Then by 5.30 in the evening, some of those thunderstorms around Kokomo toward Clinton, back around Crawfordsville and Brownsburg. So we'll see a few of those storms start to get going into the afternoon. A little bit of a question how much of a lull we're going to get here around midnight and then have more storms roll in. So you'll want to get an update with Todd Clausen tomorrow morning on Good Morning Indiana starting at 430 on the timing here. But it looks like our main threat from these storms going to be with some gusty winds, isolated bases, tornado hail, and then also some heavy rain get under a couple of thunderstorms and we're talking about maybe an inch plus of rainfall in a short period of time. So really the bottom line here. The better, uh, earlier you can get in your barbecue, the better off you're going to be throughout the day. 77 degrees at noon with a breezy south wind. Spotty storm as we go into the afternoon and those rain chances about 30% by 6 o'clock in the evening. Warm southerly winds going to keep us humid and those temperatures rising into the mid 80s for us. 85 in Lafayette, 87 in Bloomington, and 85 in Richmond. Here's your seven day planning forecast now which takes those rain chances through Tuesday, then we'll dry it out and start to warm things up. This may be the unofficial end of summer, but okay. we've got some more summer heat coming our way with storms by Friday.